hi you guys and welcome back to my youtube channel i know it's been a minute since i last uploaded here and i'm so sorry for that one of the main reasons why i did not post anything was because i was having a little social media break i just wanted to really chill and you know wind down with a lot of things that was happening in my life so i was like you know what i just really need to take some time for me um it's my cousin sister's 21st birthday and she's having a little party it's a themed party it's like blue and silver so i was like why not take you guys through and just have a little chat with you guys while i get ready i have been having a couple of changes in my life so the first thing is i drink a lot of water now this is a one liter bottle this is my second bottle for the day there are days that i don't drink as much as i'm supposed to but i mean it's one of those days let me get prepped you guys know my box of makeup which is this one <laughs> And guys, uh, I do not have like a proper makeup kit, but I did arrange it, so it's more organized. But yeah, let's get ready. So guys, to start off with, life has been really interesting. I have really learned that sometimes life can get really overwhelming and that we tend to work like robots. Um, for me, what happened was I was doing exams continuously for like seven years. I mean, I know that a lot of international school kids will have to go through this. But um, what happened to me was when I was in uni, I was doing another degree as well. And um, I really did not have like a social life because, uh, you know, doing two things is not easy. And what happened to me was like I was really exhausting myself in terms of like doing something and, and being really determined to finish it off that I was like I really lost kind of sense to what I was doing I really missed being my own self where I was really carefree and I was just chilling one of the main changes that happened in these couple of months that I was missing was um, my nine to five job um, I was on probation for three months and I finally got permanent so I had that confirmation letter that I got and I was like I had my degrees and I was doing all of these things my job was also okay and I was like you know what I am really settled in life I'm so sorry your kid is crying don't cry <laughs> uh, but like what happened was um, I felt that I was really like settled in life and I just really wanted to one get to know what I wanted to do for the rest of my life because I had my life planned for like a couple of years but after that I just really wanted to see what uh, was interesting to me what are the things that I want to continue in my life and what I don't want to do because you know when you're growing up your interests change you know priorities in life change and I wanted to see without forcing myself what I wanted to get myself into because see the thing is people all lead different lives and I did not want to base my life on um, societal pressures or like being in society or whatever you call it but I was more like this is my life I just want to see what my direction and what my take on my future was I wanted to take control of my life I was on TikTok and on TikTok I found this girl who was like giving financial advice and she was like telling the importance of credit cards and I also did see the CEO saying how important credit cards are uh, to build your credit and like you should be using your credit card and not your debit card and I was like whoa wait I've been using my debit card all this time I was like what is this and then um, I got to know that when you use your credit card bank see how good you are with your like credit and how good you are at paying it back and then like it's it's good for your credit score so when you're like trying to get a house or whatever in the future the bank will really have a good thing and just give you whatever you want so i was like you know what that sounds really good and having financial stability is always really good so i was like you know what and uh, i applied for a credit card and i got that the next thing that i did was um i really took a step back from socializing for a while i did not even post on my instagram like i really wanted to take some time because I've realized that I really don't have to prove myself to other people because, you know, I am me and it works for me and I really hate attention. 
um, growing up, I had that a lot because um, I was a prefect and like a lot of people like knew me. And it was really overwhelming for me because everyone knew what I was up to and everyone was like making rumors about me and they had, there was a lot going on and it was just too much for me and I was like, do I really want to do that? And I was like, no, that is not for me. And I was like, okay, fine. It's not for me. I then started watching Big Bang Theory. I know it's been forever and I've never watched it. It's so freaking good. Guys, I absolutely love it. It's so good. And honestly, out of all the comedies that I've been watching, that's the only thing that can crack me up so far. And I'm like, holy moly, why did not I know about this before? Like, why is it so good? And like Jim Parsons is just so cool. I love the way he acts and he's just so good. Like I'm like, how do you even remember all these lines? It's insane. I learned so much. I learn about trains thanks to Sheldon. So I'm like, that is so cool. I did not know that. And I'm super happy that I get the Marvel and DC references because I'm like a Marvel and DC fan and I never thought that I would be one, but I am. And I'm like, oh my God, I understand what they're saying. And it's like, so cool. Oh yeah, and another new thing, I got myself a tripod. I got a mic that and a tripod so you guys can see me in all different angles. And uh, yeah, I've been trying to live better now. Is it okay? I really don't want to go overboard on makeup because I really hate it. Well, you can't see this. Yeah, but that should be enough. Because it's like a night time thing and I just really don't want to go now I'm gonna do my eyeliner, so I will be back once that's done. Oh my god, I like that wing. It's so subtle but so pretty. Yay! I hope I didn't do the same thing. Okay, I need concentration, so I'll put a montage now. I am back. It looks good. And I'm happy that it's simple and pretty. Now for the eyeline on the bottom of my eye. I really like doing that. We're just having trouble finding them in this box. Oh. Found it. The kids are not having it today, not that. I just hope that my kid would never cry like that. Looks okay. Now for mascara. Oh, by the way, most of the makeup that I have is from Colorado. I really feel sorry for this kid right now. I just wish I can go and give him a hug. I think the reason why he's crying is because his parents are like, don't play right now because it's raining outside. And this fellow just really wants to play outside. Kids, I'm telling you. So that's done too. Let's put a little bit of blush. Slightly pink, pretty. Now we are gonna go for the final touch that is lipstick. This is what I'm using. This is from the ColourPop Frozen collection. This is the Anna one, which is going north. Can you guys see? Anyway, so that's that. It came broken and I got like a refund for it, but you know, your girl is all about recycling. See, it's like super broken. And voila, guys, this is my outfit. This is a batik frock, which one of my aunts made for me. It's so pretty. Um, so I have my earrings, and my Pandora bracelet. That's my <laughs> makeup. And yeah, it's a very flowy dress, and you guys should know that I really like flowy cotton dresses by now. And yeah, that's my tripod. And yeah guys, this is my outfit. <laughs> did have a small change in the end. I changed my earrings to this. So let me show you a front face uh, style of the whole outfit. Ta-da! This is me and that is how I look. This is my mom's bag. Obviously I don't have a lot of bags. So this is me. Take a road trip in a car, we'll get lost and go too far. We're on the beaches, we will watch the sunrise. 
with them is all to do. I'll just sit and stare into your loving face, graced with those beautiful eyes. I have fallen madly in love. It's around 12 p.m. right now. We just got home. We are super tired. I hope you guys really enjoyed that little get ready with me segment slash chat in this video. And guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys will stick around. So make sure you guys like and subscribe and follow me in my journey. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.